Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to be showing you this glowy summer makeup look. I start off by using this day cream by Garnier. This will keep my face hydrated throughout the entire day. Next up, I'm using this Glam Nude CC Cream by L'Oreal. This is the green one, which will reduce my redness. Um, this also has SPF 20 in it. So if your BB cream, foundation, CC cream does not have SPF in it, then please be sure to use a sunscreen before you do this step. I don't usually use my fingers to do my skin makeup, but today I did, so I'm doing some touch-ups, and that's it. Um, I am going to set the CZ Cream with some translucent powder from H&M. This is just because my cheeks and forehead usually get super oily, and I don't want that, so I'm just going to mattify it but with the powder. Next up, I'm going to be using this concealer from Viva La Diva. I'm going to apply this underneath my eyes just to brighten up the look and not make my eyes look so tired and dark. <laughs> Then I'm going to move over to some contouring. I'm going to be starting off with this bronzer and I'm going to place that underneath my cheekbones just to create some dimension in my face. Using the same palette, I'm going to be using the highlighter and I'm going to place that on top of my cheekbones just to give it that beautiful glow. Um, and yes, I'm also going to be placing it on the tip of my nose because I think that looks super cute. And then I'm going to just finish off with the blush from the same palette on the apples of my cheek to give it that natural glow. Then moving over to the eyebrows, I'm going to be using this Brow Specialist Pencil by H&M. I start off by brushing my brows upwards and then defining the line underneath and doing the same on top, brushing them down and filling them in on top. And then I just brush through them with this brush on the other side of the pencil to make the color fade out and look more natural. For the eyeshadow, I'm going to be using this matte palette by PS Makeup. Uh, I'm going to be using these two colors and the crease just to give my eyes some depth and dimension. And be sure to keep on blending because you don't want any harsh lines. Then I'm going to move over to this beautiful nude color and put that on the center of my eyelid just to brighten it up a little bit. To give this makeup even more glow, we're going to use this shimmering eyeshadow by Pierre René. Uh, I'm going to take a little brush and apply this in the corners of my eyes and then pulling the color underneath my eyes to make them look a slightly bigger and more brightened up. And then it's time for some mascara. I'm going to go ahead and curl my lashes and apply the Falsies Push Up Drama Mascara, which is by Maybelline New York and is completely waterproof. 
I know the rest of the makeup is not waterproof, but at least my mascara will stay on. So I'm just applying the mascara on my upper and my lower lashes, and I'm skipping the eyeliner today because I'm going for an even more natural look. So that's it for the eye makeup. I completely forgot to highlight my brow bone, so I'm just going to do that right now using the same shimmering eyeshadow as we used for the inner corners of our eyes. The last step is the lips. First, I'm using baby lips. This is the blue one, which has no color. It will just keep my lips nice and moist. Yes, moist throughout the day. And then I'm gonna put some concealer on the outer parts of my lips because I'm going for the gradient look. So be sure to blend out the concealer well because I totally forgot to do that on top of my lip. Well anyways, next step is the lipstick. I'm using a bright pink one by Viva La Diva. This is number 104, Surfs Up. And this I'm gonna apply on the inner parts of my lips and then blend out with my fingers. So that's it. When you're done blending, put on your summer outfit, your summer hat, and we are ready to go. What do you guys think about this look? I really think it's super pretty and perfect for summer. So, yes. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. If you did like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe for more videos, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!